Shalom, the Lord bless you. I welcome you in the name of Jesus. You are welcome to this prophetic session. God bless you. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is Awanga Iris. You are welcome to the atmosphere of possibilities. Thank you so much for joining this amazing family. God bless you. Praise the Lord. If you've already been part of this family, God bless you. You already know how much I love you. Thank you for always coming back. God bless you. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The Lord says, I should tell someone, life is being governed by principles. The Lord says, life is being governed by principles. All what you need in this life is being governed by principles. If it must work, there must be a principles that will push it to work. So many people have left the side of principles. All they want is to see it happen their own way. It doesn't work that way. The Lord took me this morning to Malachi to return. Let me read great people of God. Malachi to return, I read. Bring all the tithes into the storehouse, so there will be enough food in my temple. If you do, says the Lord, will open the windows of heaven and pour out for you blessings without measure. That is the word of the Lord for somebody. So many people are failed when it comes to tithing. This is a financial principle. Now, when God blesses the works of your hands, may God, may, when God bless you with a good job, all you need to do, when you get your salary, when you get the money from the business, all you need to do is to pay your tithe. In that way, it will secure your business. In that way, you will secure your job. Whenever something wants to go wrong, you tell God, Father, you know I pay my tithe. Automatically, God respects his principle and he's going to back that for you. But so many people have failed. They complain, I, I work money, I don't see money. Money has left me. And I cannot even say where my money has gone to. It's because you fail to apply this principle. I pray for you on that grace. As you have obeyed the word of the Lord, as you apply these principles, your finances are coming back to you in the name of Jesus. God is restoring your finances in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' precious name, amen. God bless you, great people of God. I love you. And I will see you in our next session. Shalom.